my days at UWM, I use a lot of the shop techniques. UWM alum and sculptor Tom Quioff wanted to go big for his next project, but to do that, he had to start small. Yeah. I've taken that model and made a mold of it, and this is actually a bronze panther. You know, you lift that up, it's, it's got a little heft to it. Back in June, the school approached Quioff with an idea, create a panther to celebrate 50 years of their mascot. He had to complete it by this month. I knew how I was going to do it. I just had to get it done in that time, time frame was a little tough. It's a process where you can't cast that whole thing in one piece. It was cast in 46 pieces, like a puzzle. Quioff's feline is ferocious. At 12 feet long and 6 feet tall, this 1,200-pound panther definitely has some bite. You know, when you look up panther, it really is a great mascot because it's a, it's a, a very unique animal. You know, it's a fierce hunter. Now, I know what you're thinking at home, Tim. You're breaking all the rules by jumping on the panther's back like this. But actually, you'd be wrong. Students are encouraged to get up here and take all the pictures that they want. Uh, I think it's pretty cool. Uh, I see a lot of students come by here. They'll, they'll be taking pictures with it. They'll be jumping on top, acting like they're riding it. It probably came out as good or better than what I thought it would. At heart, he's an artist, but he's also a panther, a combination that will keep his name etched in school history for years to come. In Milwaukee, Tim Elliott, WISN 12 News.